Welcome back to Andes Guides. In today's video, we are going to show you how to save a board in Miro. Let's begin. Now, the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time here in Miro, I need you to click the sign up option. And from here, just follow the on screen instructions and you're good to go. Saving a board in Miro is a straightforward process because you have to realize that Miro automatically saves your work in real time. All right. For example, um, I use the uh, comment here and I add another uh, option here. All right. So the board or matter of fact, Miro automatically saves any updates or changes you have done on the board itself unless you undo it yourself right for example i'm going to undo that this one you see so you don't have to worry for that but although mirror automatically saves your changes to your board as you work there is no need to manually save your board and again it's updated in real time however if you wanted to save a board like creating a duplicate or making a copy there's essentially another video for that that you want you know you might want to check that on our channel on how to duplicate a board or how to export a board we're not going to show you that here in this video but don't worry because all of the boards or all of the updates that you create here on this specific board are automatically saved now if a board is missing or for example you have made changes and uh, it's not saved there could be a little problem with your um, account and that means you need to contact the Miro Help Support Center all right so you can contact these uh, platforms or you can simply go to the Miro Help Center type in your questions to see if you get an answer so these are the articles and of course topics that you can check to give you to get insights and troubleshooting steps if in case you are encountering problems on your board it's not saving automatically otherwise go again to the mirror help center homepage and go to the troubleshooting and technical questions if you get one of the support staff tell them you're having problems saving a board in mirror or your mirror is not automatically saving your board all right saving a board in mirror whether automatically or by exporting and backing it up serves several important purposes and that's it for today's video thank you so much for tuning into andy's guides if you find this vet video helpful please give it a thumbs up and do not forget to hit that subscribe button to stay updated with all the latest content i'll see you in the next guide